virus. Some people are using the outbreak for their own gain. There are many warnings tonight about possible scams related to COVID-19. Our crime insider John Burkett has more on what these scams look like and how you can protect yourself. John? And Candace, not even an hour after President Trump mentioned a possible stimulus, a Chesterfield man was getting a specific text message addressed to him to click on a link and to get his money fast. A retired professor. I'm a retired professor from the University of Alaska, and now I work full time for the American Public University. Offering our viewers a lesson on something some of them may see pop up as a message via text or email on their smartphones over the course of the next few days or weeks. I got a, a, a text message that said um, that you know, because of the COVID-19 outbreak, we are giving out emergency funds to cover your everyday cost and then a website to click into a link that may be a virus infecting your phone and computers depending on where you click. You'll have people all over the world that'll randomly send text to numbers and once you click on it they've got you. You know they'll either spend malware to your phone, they'll send spyware to your phone, worse they'll send ransomware to your phone. We have to pay them money to even get your data back. Miles Turner from Law Enforcement LLC says he knows these are anxious times and a lot of people are stressed about where their next check or even meal may come from. But he urges you to read everything closely and don't fall into a scammer's trap. If you weren't expecting the message, if you weren't expecting the email, because this comes through email also, don't click on it. If it seems too good to be true, it is. And if you do click on the link, whether on your smartphone or your computer, experts say it costs anywhere from $300 to $1,000 to get that virus off of your electronics. Working for you in Chesterfield County, John Burkett, CBS 6 News.